Hey guys, it's that time again. Time to predict some fights. Uh, before we get into this prediction, though, I do want to say I will not be predicting the Eddie Hall card because the Eddie Hall card has been pulled off. It's been postponed. The accounts that were running the event have been deleted. So it's a bit of a weird thing. If anyone actually knows any more details about it, please let me know. I've heard that some fighters ain't been paid or, or the fighters haven't been paid. So please let me know. Uh, but today we're jumping into the UFC 298 predictions. Let's go. Okay, so as soon as this video is out, my bets are on. So whatever I say, whoever I predict here, that's who my bets are going on. And um, yeah, if I'm wrong, then I'm wrong. You know, maybe maybe there's things that I'm not seeing. Maybe there's things that I'm not hearing. And yeah, and I'd like to hear your opinions on it as well. So let's jump straight into it with the first fight of the night. Well, the first main card of the night. Or should we start here? I'm going to say Mackenzie Dunn. <laughs> No, uh, I was actually going to predict this fight as well, and I was going to put on Mackenzie Dunn. I think she wins, but I'm not too confident in that fight, and there's so many fights on here that I'm not confident with, but it's a bit of fun, ain't it? It's, it's like, if I'm wrong, then I'm wrong, but, you know, I'm not putting too much on, so, yeah. Here we go, Anthony Hernandez versus Roman Kopolov. I personally have Hernandez winning. Um, I don't exactly know a way that these guys win, but... Yeah, I'm going to say Hernandez have got winning that one. Then we have Marab Divalashvili versus Henry Cejudo. Uh, I'm going to say Marab. I just feel Marab's pressure will be too much. Henry Cejudo likes to take his time, you know, likes to, well, time his opponents. And maybe I'm wrong. Maybe Henry Cejudo will reach the same pressure as Marab and maybe even make him make a mistake if he's timing him and beat Davala Shavili, but I personally believe that Henry Cejudo loses his fight, and yeah, I was originally going to put my bet on Henry Cejudo, but I don't know, I just don't, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know any of these, these ones I like, because I can't predict them properly, next up is Jeff Neal versus Ian Machado Gary, uh, I personally have Ian Gary winning this fight, but who knows, Ian Gary's got a lot to prove here, a lot of pressure is going to be on him, and a lot of people don't like him, so I wonder if he'll pull it off. I personally have no nothing against him. I don't have a reason to dislike him. Maybe he's said or done something. Uh, I know he's a cuck, apparently, but I'm not going to hold that against him. I believe in Ian Gary. Then for your co-main event in the evening, Paulo Costa versus Robert Whitaker. Paulo Costa, I've, I've been reading a lot. Apparently, he's been pulling out a lot of his fights, and every single time I see him on an event, I'm like, why is he not fighting? <laughs> Because he's on the event card, but then he doesn't fight. So he's been pulling out a lot, apparently. Uh, so, I don't know. We haven't really seen Paulo Costa in a while. I believe Robert Whitaker's going to take it to him. And I think Robert Whitaker takes this. And then for your main event of the evening, I am so excited for this fight. Ilya Toporia versus Volkanovski. I do not see, I keep saying this, I do not see this fight going the full bout. And I personally have Volkanovski taking the dub in the later rounds. I see him knocking him out. I believe Volk has a lot to prove since the uh, knockout of against, uh, who was it, Islam Makhachev. People are calling him old, so I believe there's a lot of pressure on Volk, and I believe Volkanovski thrives under pressure. Ilya Taporia acting like Conor McGregor, I feel he's going to be too cocky and confident in there. And as we know, Jose Aldo wasn't very comfortable in the octagon against McGregor. Chased that right hand and then went to sleep. I believe the outcome for this fight is very different than McGregor versus Jose Aldo. These guys are very different compared to those two. And I see Volk taking it. But guys, who do you think wins? How do you think they win? Am I wrong? Am I right? And yeah, apart from that, guys, I have nothing else to add. We will find out tonight and I will see you tomorrow. I will see you all tomorrow. I'm going to do obviously my MMA tonight. But I will see you all tomorrow to see if I got it right. To see if I had won any money or if I have lost. But... Hey, who knows? We'll find out shortly. I cannot wait. Maybe there's something I'm not seeing. Maybe there's some details I've missed. But apart from that, guys, I'm going with my gut. I'm sticking with my heart. I'm sticking with my head. And yeah, we'll see. But I hope you enjoyed. Take care. Enjoy the fights. And I'll catch you tomorrow. Take care and peace, everyone. Mm -hmm.